Thank you to the Brain Foundation uh, for their generous award. Um, it's a real honour to receive this. Uh, I'm representing a multidisciplinary team this evening with a common aim to improve voluntary movement by understanding the processes in the brain that are important for movement and developing novel interventions that can effectively improve movement in neurological disorders. The team comprises Professor Michael Rosenberg, who is a population health scientist, Dr Alex Shakovich, who is a software engineer, uh, Associate Professor Chris etherton Beer is a geriatrician, Professor Jenny Rogers, who is a neuroscientist. And this diverse team has really enabled the novel and potential of the app. The app's called Got Rhythm. It's used to deliver musical therapy. We developed the app to address the critical need for inexpensive, individualised rehabilitation interventions that patients want to engage in. Music therapy can facilitate recovery of movement following neurological injury, and it's thought to do so by promoting uh, functional recovery of brain networks. However, in current music therapies, there is a separation between the music and the feedback regarding the movement. So patients perform uh, movements to music, but they're not given any feedback on how successful the movements were until the end of the session, or even when they next meet their clinician. Essentially, this means that they can be training incorrect or suboptimal movements. Got Rhythm uses a mobile phone and wireless wearable sensors to deliver musical therapy with real-time feedback. What does this look like? Well, the patient wears sensors that can measure movement. For example, the opening and closing of the hand that's required for grasping objects. The patient performs this movement to the music of their choice from their own library, their own music library. And if the movement is performed successfully, they receive feedback, the song, perhaps Johnny Cash. If the feedback is performed incorrectly or suboptimally, the music stops and is replaced by a metronome or visual feedback that is aimed at helping the patient improve that movement again, at which time the song continues to play. In the current project, we'll test the efficacy of Got Rhythm to improve upper limb function and induce changes in motor areas of the brain in subacute stroke patients. The results of our research have the potential to change the way that training therapies are used in clinics. Through the app, we give the patient the ability to perform as much training as they'd like, and during that training, we collect a battery of uh, data that we can use to further refine the application. We're incredibly excited to be able to conduct this study and we again thank the Brain Foundation for their support and we hope that um, we're optimistic really about the outcomes of this research. Thank you.